using KaiKit characters and animations in Godot. Start by importing your character. Drag the character file into your project and create a new inherited scene. Create a folder for animations. Let's call this animations source and let's drag in our animations. Note that the barbarian is using the medium rig, so we will want to use the medium rig animations as well. Drag in whichever animation set you need. In this case, I'm going to pick combat melee and movement basics, and I'm going to drag these into my animations source folder. To use these animations, we need to create an animation library. To do this, we're going to double click on our animation set, go into actions, and set animation save paths. We're going to create a new folder called animations and we're going to extract all of the animations into this this new folder set paths and re-import the animation set and repeat this for every animation set that you need then let's go back into our character scene and we're going to add a new animation player in this animation player, we can go ahead and click on animation and click manage animations to create our new library. Let's call this one player. To add new animations to your library, you want to click this folder icon, navigate to wherever you save your animations, and then select all animations you wish to add. Now that we've got our library set up, we can preview our animations. Select the animation and click play. Note that if you want your animations to loop, you need to press the looping button in the right hand corner. Now you have a character set up with an animation player and you can go ahead and add your own player script and logic and then you can play animations by referencing the animation player. To apply this setup to a different character, you can simply import your new character by dragging him into your characters folder, saving it as a new inherited scene. And then we can go ahead and copy and paste the animation player onto your new character. This new character now also has the same animation library and has access to all of the same animations that we have made for the barbarian. This was the short version of how to use Kaikit characters in Godot. If you'd like to learn more, like how to add weapons and accessories, using the large rig, using alternate textures, material settings, character customization, state machines and animation transitions, adding Mixamo or other external animations, and more, you can check out my detailed video on these subjects here. And if you like my work, you can check out my website for more assets, Check out my Patreon if you want to support me. Keep up to date with what I'm working on, on my socials or joining my Discord. Links are in the description. Thanks for watching, good luck with all of your projects.